There are many reasons, I think, that people believe that these rituals work. Shamans and folk healers all over the world are experts in addressing psychosomatic illnesses and illnesses that have a large social component. And I think that's one of the things that's really going on here. There are other sort of more personal idioms involved in these rituals. There is a sense of cleansing. There are many metaphors of cleansing in the ritual. The babki use uh, holy water. They wash the patient with the holy water, the patient's face, face and hands. The babka, as she reads the shapes in the wax, she also compels the patient to revisit events from the patient's past. This can be very therapeutic. At the same time, the babka often, also by reading the shapes in the wax, predicts the patient's future. And what I found is that that is often a positive message that the babka gives the patient about what they can expect in the future. And so the patient comes away from this ritual with a real sense of being cleansed, a real sense of calmness, and a sense of hope.